All right, so it's Thursday the 25th. I'm recording this as we have dark skies. This is the afternoons here in uh, Nicaragua, right? We It's it's uh, like 2.30 in the afternoon. I've got super dark skies. I have heavy thunder sounds, and I'm in bright sun where I am. This is what it's like. We can tell there's a big storm over Chinandega right now. So yesterday, uh, worked in the morning. We had a busy day overall. In the evening, uh, we headed out to the Simple Beach um, and hung out there for a while. Larry Emerson was playing, so we went out about 4 o'clock. But just before we were able to go out, I had a bunch of work stuff happen. So it was a very busy work day uh, between doing videos and, and actual uh, customer client stuff. Uh, it was a pretty busy day. Um, but we went out in the afternoon because Larry was going to be playing at the Sybil and we wanted to go see him. I had a number of meetings today, but I was done by about one o'clock in the afternoon. Got ready, grabbed the kids and Dominica. We went out to Sakura, the, uh, the cafe in the middle of town next to La Colonia. Uh, we got coffee, hung out for a little while, had a really nice time. I hear bits of a tree falling down from all the wind and uh, um, had a really nice time just hanging out as a family for a while. But we had to get back because we're going out to the Sybil to see Larry play this evening. So we got back and I ended up having some work I had to do. So we weren't able to leave quite on time, but by about 4.30, we were on the road, got out to uh, Simple Beach and uh, hung out, had a really nice concert. I was able to set up, did a live stream from there, a little bit different than my normal live streams. There's so much falling out of the trees. This is crazy. Um, sometimes it's the, it's the lizards dropping out. Sometimes it's coconuts falling. Sometimes it's the palm fronds falling. All kinds of things hit the roofs from here. Uh, really good concert. We had dinner out there. Loads of people came out to hang out. So we had a really cool time just hanging out with lots of friends out on the beach. Um, and it was just a really cool time. Um, and Larry is always really good. I did a full recording for uh, Nika Roomba, which is, I hope, going to be up soon. It turned out really well. It was my first real test of the Zoom H1 Essentials Recorder, which is a 32-bit. I've been using it for things, but I haven't been using it in things that are so loud. It's a live concert. I wanted to see how it did. It did really well, and it's really the the audio limitations of the concert space and the equipment, not the limitations of the recorder, I think. That's, that's now hitting us. We haven't had that in the past, so I'm really excited about that. We're going to be testing it out possibly tomorrow to see Monty at the Avia. Do the same thing, test it again. I uh, haven't had Monty on Nico Roomba in a while, so hopefully be able to get a show done there as well. <clears throat> uh, so really good show. When it was done, uh, we left the simple, brought food home for the kids, ran people around, and then we had, headed out to a family uh, event. One of our good friends is having a birthday party, and so we're part of the family and went and had a big birthday party and very traditional Nicaraguan, traditional Nicaraguan house, traditional Nicaraguan, everybody sitting around in the wicker rockers, traditional, uh, the, the I don't know what they're called, the bands that play. They're kind of like mariachi bands, but it's not mariachi music. Trumpet and clarinet and tuba and drums. They're super loud, and they come in, and they play this music, and, and they come in, and when they start playing, everybody gets up and dances for, like, a long time, and you're, like, so sweaty and hot and tired, and then they leave for a little bit, and then we were doing karaoke and having some snacks and having some drinks, and then the band comes back, and you dance, and this is all in a small house, and it's, like, super loud because you're in a tiny house with this really loud band, and you dance again, and then they go back outside, and then you relax for a little bit, then they come back again. It's such it's such a different experience than you get anywhere else. It's it's pretty crazy, but that was our evening. We did that. Um, I had a really nice time. Uh, tomorrow, we're going to be going out. We got a, a, a lot of work to do in the morning, all good stuff, and a lot of show stuff, and then in the evening, we're going out to NL Vivero, we're going out to Via Via, we're going out to Geckos. It's going to be an exhausting night, uh, as it often is on Fridays. So that was our day. Nothing specific going on other than really cool um, event. I hope people like the live stream over on my other channel. Is the only I've had no time for two weeks, not one moment that I could turn on the camera and do a live stream. Like that's how busy I've been. Uh, it's been it's been pretty exhausting. Um, I don't know why things get so busy for such long periods of time, but they really do. We're still working on scheduling when we're going to Texas. We're not sure quite yet when we're able to go. Hopefully in the next several weeks. Uh, so it's like at least twelve times something has fallen out of a tree while I'm doing this short show. There's another one. Wow. All right. I'll see you guys tomorrow.